All right, guys, tonight we're gonna do some gi techniques. Uh, we're gonna work from the closed guard. We're gonna do an arm drag series, one getting his back. Uh, the second technique will be uh, sweeping if he defends uh, his back, so. We're gonna start from closed guard. He's gonna have a little grip on my collar here. Uh, and I come, look to get the cross grip, come underneath, no thumbs on this, and grab here. That's how I break the grip. All right, this is not gonna be an easy grip to break. So, and I wanna be able to get an arm drag. So, come inside here. I'm gonna bring my body up, down. And then I'm gonna move his hand on this side. Why do I want his hand on this side? Because if I leave it on this side, he's gonna regret. And I, I, I just work for nothing. So here, break, here, come back. Try not to pinch the guy, come back, get behind the gi here. And then I'm gonna just not, you could put your foot on the ground, but if I could just shrimp off his body and get here. If I could get the wrist, I will get the wrist. Me normally, I don't normally get the wrist. I'm not that long, but if you guys are long and you can get it, it's even better. All right, now I'm gonna use this foot down to get the back, scoot out, post, drop, swing my legs around, and then I got the back here. I'm gonna show it without getting the wrist here. Just get a nice grip on the back, even if I wanna grab the gi, I can, but a nice grip on the back. And keep your chest glued to his arm, so I don't worry about losing the arm. Here, and look, move my body away, up post, slide this in, and then come in here. If I wanna flatten them out, come under the chest, here, then I can work some reps. I'll grab the arm again, here, move the hand over, Come get here. If you need to put the foot on the ground, it's not wrong. Here, reach, grab the wrist. Extend your body, up, post. Slide this hook in, then throw that hook in. One more, not using the wrist. It's a little bit more common to not use the wrist. Here. Get on top. Everyone got it? On three. One, two. All right, guys, so let's continue. He grabs a lapel, I come under, hips up, break the grip, pass it over. I look to, to drag. As I drag, I come here, and for him to stop me from going around the back, he steps up. So look, I can't, I can't get up anymore. But what I can do is come in and grab the pants. And when I grab the pants, I can do it. A nice little easy pendulum sweep. You can also go under the leg if I'm under the arm, but grabbing the pants is sufficient enough. So come here. Again, if I drag and I can reach the arm, you could also keep the arm. He steps up to stop me from the back. I come get the pants. And up. Right on top. One more now. Just getting the, the lat here, which is a lot more common than being able to get the arm. Here, this is sufficient enough. Just grabbing here. I'm gonna try to get the back, but I can't. But I look for the pants, 
and in here. And he can't post because his arm's trapped. Bring this leg all the way up, down and around. Do not have the guy roll over your leg. Watch when I'm here. This will go up and look. See how my leg was straight? And then my knee will go on the ground. And I also have arm bars when you get on top. Everyone got it? On three, one, two.